We're going to begin tonight, though, with a tragic reminder that the flu needs to be taken seriously. Health officials in Dallas tell us a previously healthy 34 year old patient has now died. And that brings the death toll from the flu to 11. Robbie Owens is working this for us tonight. She's live over at the county's health department tonight. So, Robbie, this is an adult, obviously healthy, reportedly 34, but children have died as well here. Yes, Doug, we are aware right now of 12 pediatric deaths across North Texas, and there may be more. Right now, Dallas County inv investigating two possible pediatric flu deaths. We've learned that Collin County investigating two. Earlier today, we saw just a small part of the impact of one of those losses. And nobody to you. The scripture says, um, there's a time to weep and a time to laugh and a time to mourn and a time to dance. And specifically this week, we are doing all of those things. 16-year-old Reese Termulo danced like her feet didn't belong on the ground. Still, the sudden loss of the Bishop Lynch student has been a devastating blow. I had just talked to her less than 24 hours before, and so quite unreal. Um, Kids get sick all the time and they come back to school, come back to practice. And so that was definitely unexpected for us. Reese's sudden death most likely due to the flu. Health officials say the B strain this year has hit children and young adults hard. It's tragic and it's, it's, a, it's a scary reminder just how serious this is, how, you know, people who are perfectly healthy can get the flu and have serious illness and even die. It's a message that's getting more notice now. One yesterday just left work feeling sick and she went to the doctor and she got the flu. So Gracie Escalante is finally making it a priority to get the flu vaccine. Health officials say if you aren't sick, you still have time. You can't stay away from sick people because you you live with some of them, you work, you, you know, to socialize and you just have to be careful. The health officials here say being careful means getting that flu shot and staying home if you're sick so that you don't spread a virus that spreads through the air. Live at the Dallas County Health Department, Robbie Owens, CBS 11 News.